love people well. Mm -hmm. And Bob always told people he loved them every time that he saw them, texted them or called them. Mm -hmm. Hug big, mm -hmm. Bob hugged so big. I think he used to be annoyed that Danny Tanner, all he would do is hug. And then Bob just turned into Danny Tanner himself. <laughs> yeah. And it's like, I never want to leave, leave the room without hugging people yeah. and letting them know I, I love them. And that's all because of Bob. First, I wanted to send my condolences to you and thank you. you know, I, I feel like we all lost a piece of our childhood when Bob passed away, but I know that you lost yeah. obviously one of the closest friends that you have. I mean, how are you doing? I'm doing okay. You know, there's every day it feels a little bit better, but then it, it'll it hit you out of nowhere. And as I'm doing press today to talk about the movie, everyone's asking me and, you know, it, it at times it feels great because I want to, I want to talk about Bob. I want to keep his legacy alive. Mm -hmm. And then other times I'm like, okay, this is like, this is hard to keep talking about him. I'm sure it is. What do you feel like you're going to miss the most about him? Or what do you miss the most about him? Honestly, just his friendship. His friendship was so wonderful. And and he was such a caring person and, and a fun person to be around yeah. and loving and kind. And it's it just, you know, anything you needed, Bob was always there. So I will I will really greatly miss his friendship and uh, and the laughs and the hugs. Yeah, definitely. I know that you have a very strong faith and I know when things mm -hmm. like this happen, is it ever hard for you to kind of make sense of it or ever question your faith in a way? I don't question my faith. Mm -hmm. I, I believe with all of my heart that God knows everything that's happening and there's nothing that catches him by surprise or he, do he doesn't make mistakes. But of course, I'm going to have a lot of questions when I when I get to talk to God face to face one day. And, um, you know, I just. But it, it, it always it always makes me cling closer to God. And I think a lot of people I mean, I, I love God in the good times, but I'm so grateful that he's there in the difficult times because the Bible says God loves uh, and brings comfort to those who are brokenhearted. He's close to those who are brokenhearted. Mm -hmm. And I definitely feel his presence in in those times all the more. Yeah. And that's comforting. Yeah, definitely. And I know what's been comforting, I'm sure you and the cast have been by each other's side throughout this mm -hmm. entire thing. I mean, has it brought you even closer together? I don't know if, if the full house cast could get any <laughs> closer. Honestly, we are we are family but uh we we're still talking a lot and but we always have i think if anything uh, for for me it's definitely brought me and kelly closer mm -hmm. and i love kelly of course bob's bob's wife mm -hmm. she's a wonderful person but now it, i'm talking we're talking even more often than than we did which is wonderful yeah her strength has been extraordinary um, over mm -hmm. these past few weeks. And I, you know, how, how is she doing? As well as she can be doing, mm -hmm. you know, she, um, she has such a, a, a big support system around her, mm -hmm. which is wonderful. And we are all there for her and she's taking it one day at a time, but mm -hmm. she's a strong, strong woman. Right. And, and her faith is strong as well. Mm -hmm. I love that you all got together and kind of hunkered down together um, shortly after mm -hmm. Um, Bob's passing and, and and John Mayer was an honorary member of the Full House mm -hmm. cast as well. I mean, you know, that had to be um, maybe a therapeutic experience, I would imagine, too, kind of sharing some wonderful memories that you had with him. Yeah, I mean, that was kind of, I don't even know the word to describe that week mm -hmm. that we were all together. It, it's a bit surreal when I go back and think about it, but it was kind of like full house living in a house together <laughs> for a week with, with John Mayer and Jeffrey Ross. <laughs> so, um, we, but we had lots of good stories, like lots of great things that we just, we were just constantly talking about Bob and mm -hmm. there was a lot of healing and comfort in that. Mm -hmm. And, um, yeah, and then there's days where I'm like, man, I miss hanging out with everyone in the house together. <laughs> like, that's pretty. That's pretty cool. Yeah, definitely. I mean, looking back, I mean, you have so many memories. What is the one that always kind of sticks out in your mind? Oh, honestly, there. 
there are there are, there are too many to pinpoint one but um you know because my relationship has been so long with Bob it's been 35 years I really have very you know visual memories of hanging out and being with him when I was a child when I was like 10 and 12 years old and then moving into a different kind of relationship when I was 17 18 19 and was more like a peer and hanging out with him and and Scott Weinger together Bob would like take the two of us and and you know we'd go out to dinner and and it was like we were young adults and that that was cool and then it you know morphed into a very different relationship as as adults mm -hmm. and so I have you know there's so many very strong memories over such a, a lifetime you know that I just continue to go back to yeah definitely I mean and then finally I mean what is that one lesson that Bob taught you that you will always take with you and what do you think he would hope that his legacy would be love people well mm -hmm. and Bob always told people he loved them every time that he saw them texted them or called them mm -hmm. hug big mm -hmm. Bob hugged so big I think he used to be annoyed that Danny Tanner all he would do is hug and then Bob just turned into Danny Tanner himself <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and it's like I never want to leave leave the room without hugging people yeah and letting them know I, I love them. And that's all because of Bob.